Hey guys, Tucker Mantel here for my first video of my new YouTube channel series that I'm calling Tucker's Tutorials, where I'm just going to be sharing some different licks and exercises and patterns and things to practice, different ideas and tips on improvisation and so forth. Um, I'm going to divide it up in the week with three different videos per week. Uh, Monday is going to be Blues Lick of the Week for the Monday Blues. And then uh, Wednesday is going to be Wednesday Workout, where it's just going to be uh, different patterns and exercises. Uh, different things I like to work on uh, to improve technique and fluidity. And on Friday, which is today, it's uh, going to be called Friday Finish Line, where I play a line or a lick, and then you submit an audio or video response finishing the lick for me. Um, all of these videos and more materials can be found on my website, tuckerantel.com. Click on the tutorial section, and um, you'll see the videos there, including sheet music of the licks that I've played, or other materials to help you out with the practicing. Um, and so subscribe uh, below and also uh, comment uh, any suggestions or uh, things that you'd like to see. So let's get started with the Friday finish line. Um, this lick um, could be thought of as a C major lick or also an A minor lick, the relative minor. So um, I guess I'm thinking right now on a C major seven concert that is. So D for tenor and A for altos. And it goes like this. One, two, three. One, two, three. So slow down. One, two, three. So a response you might send to me um, could sound like this. You start with the lick, and then you keep on going with uh, your own idea of how it should end. That could be an option, or you could try this, too. Or you could extend it and make it even longer. Lots of different things you can do. Of course, I changed keys there a little bit. You're free to do that. You can play over any kinds of changes you want. I really like practicing these kinds of things to um, sort of build up your creativity and also uh, work on fluidity, getting in and out of licks, um, and so forth. It also helps uh, you um, practice getting different variations on licks you've learned instead of always playing it the same way every single time. So um, that can be a really fun and very helpful thing to do. So cool, have fun with that. I look forward to your responses. And I will see you on Monday with the Blues Lick. See you then.